Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading Down to Earth episode 184. Um, of course, you guys know the policy about why I have to blur on YouTube, but if you guys don't want to deal with the blur, feel free to watch this on Patreon. If you guys do want to support me on Patreon, uh, it will be at, at patreon.com slash CKT Chaotic. Um, all the money that I earn through YouTube, Patreon, and Twitch, I do stream games on Twitch. Uh, we'll be going towards the diaper fund, which is anything for the baby, for diapers, food, um, clothing, which we're good on clothes. But yeah, or it goes to his um, savings for when he use it when he's older. So everything you guys do, even watching ads on YouTube, literally does support me every way. So anyways, let's go ahead and get started. Would you like to see my last day on Zodia? Only if that's okay with you. I wish to open up to you more. Just take it slow, okay? So that's how they extract it? That night, I could not focus on sleep. After the pain subsided, my mind would always race. Are you feeling better, Lady Zadia? Zeta? The headache has calmed down, yes. Sorry, guys. One. Trying to pass some gas. Thank you. We can remove the packs now. There we go. A fresh new forehead. Oh. I am certain it feels as though a weight has been lifted. Yes. When the crown is removed, my head feels so light and free. It feels much better. <laughs> I could only imagine it. Huh? Um, excuse me, my lady. M may, may I take these, Your Grace? Um, why would you want them? What would be their purpose? Oh, I, it would be bring many blessings to my family. Sometimes so brilliant and beautiful coming from the lady herself would bring luck to me and my loved ones. I, I did not ever hear of this. I thought we needed to savor each piece of Zodianite for the sake of our planet. Uh, yes. <laughs> well, not many people know about it. It is a secret, of course. Such a big secret, you cannot tell the others about it. This keeps between you and I only. Please, your grace. May I have this as a secret gift? A gift to my whole family? Do as you please. Oh, th thank you, my lady. You have changed our lives for better. Rest and heal tonight. I will see you again for your next appointment. Yet another person to tell me something different. It was not adding up. You usually shed more than this. Where's the rest? I do not know. Are you hiding them somewhere? Why would I wish to do that? Leave me be. Your medic, did you see her still any? I did not see anything. I will have to speak with her immediately. Remember, if it were not for me, you would be alone. Zara. Can you teach me to fly now? I am an adult Zodian, and I have seen younger Zodians flying. I do not understand why I am always not ready. As I have said recently, 
and will again remind you. Give it seven more days. I'm awfully busy with other matters. But you said that the day before. Seven days. If you can, if you continue asking, I will add seven more days. Get a rest. So mean. That is when I realized I'm doing this for Zodia. For Zodia. For Zodia. For Zodia. What is the point? Living like this? For Zodia? If I'm so important, why am I being treated like a prisoner? Should people not respect me? But what, what are you? The outsider found you horrifying. I am being lied to. I cannot take it anymore. And I had to do something about it. That's... Though the art is very cute and poppy and sweet. Like, you know, the story is actually really dark. So, of course, you can tell, like, she had she has servants or like people coming in calling her you know pretty much like lady your grace kind of titles and you tell like she is of higher rank but within her family they treat her like a lab rat you know and it's kind of sad and it's kind of crazy like you know she kind of broke out of that and realized she's a prisoner because normally people who was who are born into that and raised as that they don't know like the difference from a this is normal or am i really a prisoner am i being cap <sighs> captured and you know harvested for whatever it is it's kind of insane that she broke out of that but wow it's really sad like for me i think of it as like hey this is a story, but in real life, there's people who are literally living in something like that. And, you know, we're humans and people get kidnapped and yeah. All right. I'm going to ramble on forever if I don't shut down now. But all right, guys, if you guys enjoyed the way I read this and reacted to this webtoon, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.